Hey everybody, Mental Fox here. Welcome back to Dave the Diver. So at the end of the last episode, I was talking about catching more tuna for this event here. And I didn't want to dive back in here until I knew how to get some more of those net traps to catch them. So I went, I went online and I checked. And sure enough, you're supposed to buy them from old, uh, what's his face here? Cobra. But he doesn't have them every day. It's just random. So if he doesn't have them, you can't buy them. And that's too bad. Too bad. I wonder what this C up here in the corner is. I don't know. But I don't think I need an ink bomb. And these things, I don't care about. Um, but yeah, I wonder what that C up there is. I don't know. We could sell some things, like the silver bowl. We could sell it and get a whole 50. Oh, wow. Oh, we have several of these. I didn't realize. I mean, you know, even 250 coins is not that great. But hey, whatever. It's something to sell. So, no tuna nets for us, which sucks. We still need to go to where the delivery ship sank. I think that might be the most important thing to do. These other things will show up as we're swimming around. Spent a lot of money in the last episode upgrading our suit and such. New thing in to do. Uh, that's just this, and we've already seen these in this. Hopefully our eggplant and carrot are growing over here. I think they are. We've got a couple days before he comes back. The VIP who wants vegetable sushi. Let's dive. So last time I dove in here and I went over to the right, for some reason thinking the ship would be over here. I'm just going to go straight down if I can. I'm not really sure. You know, no idea where for sure we're supposed to go to uh, get this um, thing. And here I am already picking stuff up. That's how you upgrade things, man. You pick stuff up. So that sound you hear is the tuna. This is uh, some seaweed. Uh, I also read that you can get like an electric tip on your uh, harpoon that helps a lot with the tuna. Gun enhancement kit. That up upgraded my net gun. Not gonna help me much here. Okay, well, I'm just gonna dive pretty much straight down and see what we come up with. See if we can't find this ship. Underwater scooter, sure. What's this on the wall? This almost looks like a, like a door here. Get out of this, get off the screen. With a control panel next to it. You see that? That's kind of what it looks like to me. I can't interact with it though, so I don't know what the deal is. If I wanted to, I could shoot my nut gun over here. And Catch a bunch of these little guys. Get some pyramid butterfly fishes. Why not? Get some yellow tang. Um. Yeah, let's let's just catch some of these fish, and maybe they'll end up in our um, fish tank. I well, obviously can't catch a shark with my net. Darn it, shark, get away. Dang it, shark. Dang it, shark, I'm trying to have some fun here and you're here ruining all my fun. Go away. Luckily, there's some oxygen right here, which I don't think I'm going to be able to get because this stupid shark. Yeah, doggone it, shark. Dang it. Ow. Ow. This shark is persistent. Well, I'm dead. Doggone it, man. Well, that's not a fun day of diving. That's not fun at all, you stupid shark. What do I want to keep? Um, I'm going to keep some of these butterfly fish. I don't know, man. Whatever. Doggone it, man. That sucks. That just sucks, man. Oh, well. Now it's nighttime. Let's go. Let's go to the tuna party. 
not really in the mood to party right now. I just got butt kicked by a shark. All right, let's go. Oh, okay. Yeah, wrap up the day. Let's move it. Let's go. That's... That's disappointing, man. Uh, ingredients arrived. This is the stuff from our fish farm. Check conditions for increasing your rating in the Cooks app. Sure, sure, sure. I mean, we could do that. We've done that occasionally, and we need... The thing that's holding us back is frickin' 250 tastes. We need to research one more recipe to check this one off, but we're just so far away from this. So, tonight is the event. Right? Let's see, a uh, calendar. Party. It just says party. Doesn't give me any other information. Tuna Yacht Party, select. Can't select it. I was kind of hoping it would give me a little bit more information than that. Okay. So we want all of our tuna dishes ready to go. Oh, uh, this is, um, we need to talk to Boncho about, so there's this guy down in the Sea People land who is farming seaweed or something. But he won't talk to a human unless we can make a dish that uses seaweed. A simple dish using seaweed will not leave a strong impression. They probably have that at the Sea People Village. First, bring me seaweed, white rice, and sea urchin. I'll give them a harmonious blend of ingredients from the land and sea. Hmm, white rice, sea urchin, and seaweed? I'll have to try gathering them. Don't we already have those? I think we do. You've brought the ingredients. Then I'll start preparing sea urchin seaweed rice. Lovely. Here, the sea people should be satisfied with this. Thank you, Boncho. Let's bring it to the sea people farmer. Okay, we'll get to that. And now if we talk to Boncho. If you are low on seasoning, you can send staff to get it. It may take a while, so prepare ahead of time. Seasoning? Are the ingredient preparations going well? Get the menus ready before the operating hours. Okay. Yes. So. Um... Research. I don't think there's anything else that I want to research here. Stellet puffer. I don't have any of that in my inventory. This guy, nothing. Yeah, there's a lot of Stellet puffer stuff here. Small star spotted dart. Need to get some of those. Eggplant. We'll have that here in a moment. All right, let's get our menu ready. And we want to focus on tuna dishes. This is tuna. This is tuna. This is tuna. Let's enhance our tuna. We have so much of it. Why not? We're gonna go ahead and enhance the tuna. Oh, geez. Okay, our tuna. Whoa, 216. Well, maybe we'll get to 250 sooner than we thought. I got 29 of these. Oh, this might be the the secret here. Let's sort by taste. Yeah, man. We get 29 of these. If we enhance this one, we'll only get it up to 101. But we're gonna enhance it anyway. Did I look at this right? One f 155. Oh. Huh. What did I look at before? Maybe I was looking at the price. Because we're not as close as I thought. But we're going to go enhance these. Because I don't think we're going to sell that much of it. Okay. So we've enhanced the heck out of our tuna. Let's put these 14 pieces of tuna on our menu. Set it to auto supply. 
And then this tuna, put it on our menu, set it to auto supply. And this tuna. Okay. Unfortunately, I think those are the only tuna, whoops. Those are the only tuna dishes we've got, I think. Pretty sure it is. Um, yeah, there's no more tuna. So in that case, maybe we just go by price and just put some expensive stuff on the menu here and see if we can't make some money. Vampire squid sushi. Let's see, we have 10 of these frilled shark sushi. Go ahead and enhance that, put that on the menu. And then, f well, not finally, we have three more slots left. We could put um, sea grape special sushi. I mean, why not? Let's go ahead and put that on our menu. And uh, vampire squid sushi. Put that on our menu. And then finally, barrel eye sushi. Because we have eight of these. That's it. Our menu is full. Let's get ready to make some money. Now, the thing that concerned me was when Boncho said something about ingredi or, yeah, ingredients or something. Uh, operation costs increase the more employees there are. You may end up running at a loss if you only sell cheap dishes. Okay. He's got all kinds of advice. No matter how busy you are, you need to do cooking research. There will be customers looking for new menu items. Uh-huh. Yeah. Are the ingredient preparations going well? Well, that's... Yeah. It was difficult to scare fresh vegetables, so it's nice to have a field to grow them. Don't forget to visit the farm and sow some seeds. Okay. All right. Um, let's go ahead and open this place, I guess, huh? I don't have a lot of money. So we've got a, a, a 90 serving here, a 95 here, a 330 cooking here, and a 116 cooking here. He's really slacking. I could train him to get him up to 141. It only costs 308. Let's do it. So he's up to 141 now. And heck, we could train him again, get him up to 166. I don't know if that this helps him make dishes quicker or what. Probably does. Cracks me up how Maki here is so amazing at cooking, but is terrible at everything else. But that's fine. We just wanted to cook. Well, here we go. This is a big night for us. Gonna make a lot of money, hopefully. Here we go. They're looking, they're looking. Oh, oh, I guess these are VIPs or something that are all glowy. We are going through the wasabi. So somebody in the comments told me that my servers prioritize the people farther away. So I'm going to let my servers take care of them because they're quicker than me. I really don't like pouring these drinks at all. They take too much time. Way too much time, I think. Way too much time. Boy, these people are impatient. Oh, crap, man. Okay, I need to let that be. I gotta go over here and make some more wasabi. Okay, we made more masa wasabi. Uh oh, I just heard a bad sound. Somebody's not happy. Oh, who wants this dish? Nobody wants this dish. What the hell? It's all oh, there. They are way down there. I didn't see you sitting there. Sorry about that, sir. Okay, it's starting to slow down a little bit. Let's make sure that this person gets a drink. And 
the place up. So I, we're not going to get a five star, I don't think. I heard a bad sound. Like I said, I don't know what it was. Somebody must not have gotten served. There we go. That was a busy night indeed. Let's see how we did. Hmm, only 22 new likes and 8,000 net profit, which is by far the most we've ever done. Sushi man. <laughs> I like this graphic up here. All oh, these people will get some thumbs up from these people. Best tastes of a 180. We're getting closer, but still have a ways to go. I need to get me some, some tuna, man. I guess every day, the first thing I need to do is check to see if Cobra is indeed selling those traps. Farming report is available. Okay, good to know. Okay, farming report. Okay, I guess I'll look at the farming report. Farm now. Uh, oh, we have one weed. And, um, oh, we can go back and look at the history here. Interesting. But today, Friday, we have a weed. We have five things growing. Look at our cooksta like we always do every day. This guy says, too good to eat. It's just beautiful. That is beautiful. Today was a good day. Went all out. Whoops. Um, oh, well, huh? This guy says, if you want sushi, tunis, tuna sushi is where it's at. You know, I wouldn't argue with that. Tuna sushi is good. One eighty. We're getting closer. Okay. Um, let's go to the farm and get those weeds. Okay. So here's some weeds growing. So I guess the sushi just grows automat. Or not sushi. The fit. The what is this stuff? Rice. The rice grows automatically. I don't need to plant it. And over here... Oh, okay. Do I need to water these? I have no idea. I'm out of water, though. Am I supposed to water these guys every day? I don't know. And then we've got, like, a little thing here. Dave's storage. Okay. Uh, so these aren't ready to be picked yet, I guess. You have anything new to say to me? Oh, you have nothing. Oh, wait a minute. Talk. Yep, okay, he just says the same thing over and over again. And then we could shop. Could expand our rice patty. Let's do that. The rice patty will be expanded at the beginning of the next... Well, hold on a second. Before I do this... Um, that's ah, it. Well, okay, here, here's my hesitation. My hesitation is what if Cobra has those steel traps I need and they're expensive? Let's go see. Let's see. I should have checked this before. Let's see if Cobra has the traps today. Let's make sure we have enough money to buy them. There it is. Sensor bomb trap. Oh, good grief. They're super cheap, man. This is what we want. Okay, so this little C here means this is an exclusive item you'll only find in the Cobra shop. You can find these. You know what? This isn't what I want. This is not what I want. I want a steel trap, not a sensor bomb trap. But we might be able to still get the tuna this way? I don't know. They won't be in very good shape. Well, let's buy it and see. Gun enhancement kit. I don't know, man. That's disappointing. Come on. Cobra, get the stuff I need, man. Jeez. I'm gonna start shopping someplace else. Anyway, back to my farm. We're gonna expand our rice patty. Let's go ahead and do that. Okay. To the shop. Expand our rice patty. All right, I'll slightly expand the rice patty after the next harvest. We mean slightly, I just gave you 3,000 gold. And I wonder how we open up new plots. Oh, interesting. If I stand on it, let's see. Look at that. He falls off. Look at that. 
Um, eggplant seeds. Well, let's just buy three of these and get some garlic seeds. Hopefully these don't go bad. Okay. Yeah. See, I can't. I can't plant these. At some point, he'll open that up for us. I guess. Who knows? Who knows when? Oh, wait a minute now. Hold on. Let me pick it. Okay, I have the eggplant seed chosen. Yeah, I can't do anything with it. Okay. All right. Let's get out of here. Back to the boat. So, uh, I'm going to try to blow up some tuna, I guess. See if that works. I mean, I only have one of those bombs. It's not like I have a whole bunch of them. So, I don't know, man. I'm not liking this. So this net gun thing that I was using to um, catch fish and the hopes that we would get some, some fish eggs. Let's dive. What, what, what's my game plan here? What am I doing? Why am I going down here? What do we have on our to-do list? To find the crowbar. I need to find this delivery ship. I think that I think that's the most important thing. This, need to return to the sea people. Uh, I need to return to the sea people. We haven't found the shining jellyfish yet. Uh, this one, we need to find the underwater lake. Uh, we need to find more opals. Uh, win the card game. Take pictures of a manta ray. Yeah, I still don't know where this is either. And then vegetable sushi. These are growing right now. Hopefully they'll grow soon. And spider crab. Fossils. Okay. So I don't want to return to the sea people yet. I don't think it's ready. We're ready to do that. So we're going to go in here. We're going to try to use this to catch tuna. I don't think it's going to work, but we'll try it anyway. Um, maybe I'll use my net to catch fish to send over to the farm. And we'll look for the delivery ship again. And we'll hopefully won't get beaten up by a freaking shark again like we did yesterday afternoon. Dumbo octopus. Okay. All right, let's go. Straight down. Um, here is some Kajime. Red starfish. We've got. Let's see what's in here since we're here. Uh, shock harpoon tip. Well, that's the thing that supposedly we could use to um, catch tuna. Actually, I guess I kind of forgot I was going to try to catch tuna. Oh, I have three of these bombs. Where are you, tuna? Tuna's usually in shallow water. And normally they're very loud. Are tuna only out on certain days? I don't know. Hmm. Not hearing any tuna. Jellyfish here, and I can't go any further to the right. Huh. Whoa. Uh-oh. What's this? Oh, it's the big whale again. That's the family of the humpback whale I met earlier. Should I take a picture? Hmm. Let's see here. Uh, oh. Fail. Oh gosh, everything's wrong. We want a baby hump back whale and we want some splashing water. That's what we want. Fail. Okay. Oh. <laughs> These aren't baby humpback whales. These are just some dumb old fish. Oh, damn it. I did cancel. Okay, hold on. All right, hold on. Come back. Baby humpback whale, where are you? Come back. Oh. Oh, it just passed by. It won't come back for a while now. 
So let's wait for the next turn. Yeah, I, that sucked. I screwed that up. Oh well. So Tuna, where are you? No Tuna today? Is that what I'm learning? Oh, get away from me! Can I catch one of these guys in a net? Oh no, I cannot! He just bro broke right through the net. Yeah, I've about had enough of your crap. So I'm catching multiple of the same fish because I think that's how you make more fish. So really, no new tu no tuna today. Is that what you're telling me, game? You're not gonna give me any tuna? The mysteries of the deep. You never know what you're gonna get or not get. As much as I like this piece of music that plays, I wouldn't mind if it mixed it up a little bit. I'm gonna be honest with you. Let's see here. Um, I want to get some fish from more than 50 meters down. Fill up a different part of my um, fish f farmery. Ooh, what's this? Narrow barred Spanish mackerel. Okay, you sure are pretty. Let's get you two. <laughs> I'm going to add you to my collection. Dusky grouper. Oh, now, don't be like that. Let's see what we get out of this. Um, sure. Let's get this thing in case we need to fight a shark. Or a barracuda in this case. I think the barracuda I could hit with a regular old... Oh gosh, he's fast. Slurp? He was an overpopulated invasive fish. Well, that looks like a ship right back there. Can I go over there? Ooh, barracuda. Great barracuda. This is looking awfully shipwrecky. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I'm going to go ahead and swap out this thing, and then I'm just going to go ahead and um, take the oxygen, and then I'm going to pick that up. It's all, it's all, it's all strategy. It's important strategy. I keep wondering if I'm missing something. Uh, like, is there like some clue as to where this sh this sh sunken ship is that I'm looking for? Oh, an upgrade kit. Pretty cool. Hi, right, what kind of fish are you? Sure are pretty. So I'm gonna kill you. It's putting up a fight. He's a tough one to catch. Giant Trevally. Where is this boat, man? Now we're in the depths. Would it be in the depths? I don't feel like I have any clues to go off of. Look at this beautiful fish. I want it for my collection. Uh -uh. 
reminds me of uh, oh, I'm overweight all of a sudden. Of uh, you ever play those um, old like track and field games where you would like there's like an arcade one where you smash buttons all turn alternate alternately over and over again. I don't want to be over encumbered, so we're going to drop some what? And I really don't want to drop anything. This this uh stuff is heavy. Still over encumbered. Hmm. Well. this guy down here well I mean I've made it to the bottom and I still don't see a boat and I kind of hesitate to pick anything else up yeah I don't I don't want to go through the the tube worm tunnels because logically it doesn't make any sense that the ship I'm looking for would be you know, through those tunnels doesn't make any sense. But I'm not having any luck finding this ship. So I'm going to leave this hole and try to dive in a different place, I guess. But yeah, I'm like, is there like some kind of radar tool or some kind of compass I'm supposed to be using to find this? Oh man, look at that, a big old hammerhead shark. So I'm having no luck at all finding this ship. And then there's other things I'm supposed to be finding too for the sea people. Well, here is a ship. Is this where I'm supposed to go? I, don't, I hope. Under sunken ship. Oh, there we go. Find a crowbar. Okay. I like how it says find a crowbar. It doesn't say find the crowbar. Just find a crowbar. Any crowbar will do. Will do. There's a shark over there. Whoa, whoa. There it is. <laughs> the fish look interested. Oh, there it is. Cobra's crowbar. Say that five times fast. But it's buried under the rocks. I need to remove the rocks. Okay. What's the challenge in removing the rocks? Let's remove the rocks. Let's kind of fling them over there. Get out of here, rocks. Oh, hey guys. What the heck? What the? <laughs> Oops. It looks like I aggravated a colony of crabs. Oh, they look ferocious. I need to deal with them to pick up the crowbar. Yeah, well, I'm gonna drop some rocks on you, you cute little Mario crabs. Uh, what the? What just happened there? Whoa, oh, 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 oh. Am I supposed to shoot him? Dang it, this doesn't seem to be doing anything at all. Okay, shooting them is not the solution. Oh, jeez. Can I just like... Oh, I must bring a crowbar. There must be a way to defeat those crabs. I was going to say, can I just swim away from them? No. Let's see here. If I swim away... Yep, okay, so it's not going to let me leave. I mean, I thought I would just drop rocks on him, but that didn't seem to work. Get away from me. Get away. Oh, okay, we got one of them. I need some oxygen, man. I don't know if I would be able to get it, though, before they hit me again. The music's cute, I'll give it that. Dang it, get away from me. Okay, another one gone. 
another rock down here. What are you gonna do about it? Thwomp. Hey, what the? Whoa, oh, oh. pick it up. Get away from me! Okay. Oh! There. Ooh, that was a tough fight. Let me pick up the crowbar and go up. Oh, maybe I will, maybe I won't. Pick up the crowbar. Now I'm overweight again. Good. This must be the crowbar that Cobra mentioned. Mm. Why does it look familiar? <laughs> oh, I don't know. Let me get to the boat. Well, I'm over encumbered again. It is my lot in life to be over encumbered. Okay, so at least we accomplished that. But there's still so much more for us to do, man. Still need to find a shining jellyfish. Uh, there's some signs in deep waters we're supposed to follow. Quite a bit left for us to do down here. So what has over encumbered me now? Oh, we picked up some, some crab. It's in horrible shape though, but it's not something I see very often. So I hesitate to get rid of it. Um. Hmm. It is in horrible shape. Weighs four kilograms. Well, see you later. I don't need no terrible condition food. Um. Well. Oh man, we got a shark over here. Maybe we. Maybe we should just go back up to the boat because I'm over encumbered and like killing that shark isn't going to do me any good because I wouldn't be able to get its meat anyway. I mean, I could and just, you know, be over encumbered for a bit, but uh, let's get out of here. I need to upgrade my um, cargo. I just, I, whoa, look at the size of that guy. Can't believe how quickly I get encumbered. Let's get out of here. <laughs> oh, that's the one I ordered. Ha 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 ha. So, you take this to the rock, insert it between the cracks, and pull it hard like this. Then you will be able to take out the rock. Ha ha. Nice. I will be able to move the mirror with this. Ha ha ha, that's good. Since you're here, why don't you check your gear? And don't forget to stop by Bancho Sushi. What? Don't tell me what to do. Okay, now we need to go back to the Glacial Passage. Okay. Oh, Otto's calling us. Hey Dave, the crops planted a couple of days ago are ready to be harvested. Seriously? They grow so fast. Ha <laughs> ha, all kinds of unexpected things happen at the blue hole. We need to prepare the ingredients for vegetable sushi before the customers come. Hurry to the farm. Let us hurry to the farm. The weather here is incredible. The crops are growing so well. Go harvest them for yourself. Harvest the full-grown plants. Harvest, harvest, harvest. Harvest, harvest, harvest. There's a little bit of randomness to how many you get when you harvest them. 
Wow, the eggplants and carrots look really nice. Visit often and show your love, and the, and the plants will repay in kind. Now, take them all and go help make vegetable sushi. I have other vegetable seeds as well. I will sell them at a reasonable price if you want them. And don't forget that good ingredients are what make a good dish. Thanks! Now all I need to make vegetable sushi is some white rice. By the way, who ordered vegetable sushi? Okay, we're gonna plant some seeds. Let's go ahead and plant some eggplants. Eggplants, eggplants, and we'll plant some garlic, 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 and some garlic, okay? And now we're gonna water. Water, water, although it looks like it's already wet, huh? No, it doesn't hurt anything, I have an unlimited supply of water. The only thing it takes is a little bit of time. What are these signs down here? Well, we do need to uh, pick those or pull those. Okay, he's not gonna tell us anything new. Okay, that's it, man. Doesn't look like there's anything for us to do here. This will be ready in a day. That's all we can do there. We can go check out our fish. Does he say anything to us here? Uh, I'll tell you when the fish hatch, so drop by then. Okay, don't need to worry about that. Uh, 43%? Oh man, we got all kinds of weird fish in here, don't we? Okay. No tuna. I mean, look at all the blue tang we've got. We can... Still don't know how to go about changing these. Number of flesh chunks. Boy, that sounds delicious, doesn't it? Extra flesh chunks, please. Got some fish being grown here. These are new. I mean, we have so much fish. So, I mean, I guess I could, I don't know. If I send all of these over here, does that mean they won't, there'll be no fish left to mate? I don't know, man. I don't know, this is more work than I care to invest time in. I don't know, I'll leave it alone for now. So what other other parts can I open up? Mm, glacier passage area, a night area, and then we could expand our other areas. Let's go ahead and open up glacier passage. We're gonna be going back in there at some point. Back to the boat. Hmm, maybe time to upgrade your upgrade your equipment. Sure. I mean, maybe, yeah. Let's see what he's selling. Well, same stuff. Okay, never mind. All right, let's look at our eye diver. Cargo box. Let's get this up to 94, man. I'm tired of being over encumbered all the time. I'm tired of it, I tell you. You can bring more fish, it says. One of these days we'll buy this, but we are a ways off from that. All right. Well, I'm going to end this episode here. Uh, let's see. When we come back next time, it is the afternoon. Um, we will uh, do some more diving. Maybe we'll see if we can't find the shining jellyfish. Maybe we'll find signs for the underwater lake. Maybe there will be some tuna. I don't know, man. A lot of stuff that could happen. Come back next time and find out. Thanks for joining me on this episode. Hope you had a good time. If you did, why don't you let me know? Let me like or a comment. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.